So, good morning. Hi. Uh, today I work on the kilns and the kilns are special buildings that we need to burn the bricks. So the process is you need some clay mines and dig for clay and then you bring it to the brick factory that we already worked on the last couple of weeks. I think so. We, uh, we had three sessions for creating the, the brick factory and now I work on the kilns but the kilns uh, they take the the raw bricks and they burn it and so they need a lot of wood and uh, then they uh, uh, when they are burned they go to the special storage the, the brick storage <clears throat> and I already created the kilns but this is uh, already a year ago and I have some new skills and I'm not so happy with the building so I think I have to upgrade them and that's what we do today. So I hope you like it and uh, let's zoom in. <clears throat> So, okay, what we see here, let's go to the first, first picture here. We see the two kilns that I already have and this is the game view. So this is how it actually looks in the game. <clears throat> I'm sorry, we have two kilns. We have the small one and we have the larger one. This one it is kind of a fantasy building, but the structure is based on a sketch that I saw in Vindonissa. So it's not a fake building, <clears throat> but uh, it's just this building here. And I think in real it's a little bit bigger than here, but it's just a sketch, so I'm not sure. Then we have the second one that I will work later on. And this is a real kiln from uh, Germany, from I think it's Gegenbach. <clears throat> and uh, this is also a sketch. I was there uh, and many people complained about the buildings uh, and uh, they have they are right in some kind. So let's go to this building. This building here, this is absolutely perfect based on the sketch that I saw. And uh, oh, it's just a second. I will check if the audio works of this stream. I'm not sure. <clears throat> it seems it works. Yeah. Okay. Good morning, Defro. Good morning. So. Uh, Death Row, uh, I think I should also be on uh, on Twitch live now. I'm not sure. I just tried and uh, I'm not sure if you watch. No, you're from, uh, you're from, you on, you're on YouTube. So, okay. <clears throat> and uh, so this building is actually correct, but I don't like it. Uh, I don't like the straight lines here and the chimney. I have to improve some stuff, but let's go here to this building. This building is wrong, but uh, the wrong part is the roof of this inner building. And uh, a, a guy complained, he's a researcher. He has a PhD for, uh, for Roman kilns. So uh, he said these buildings were open. So I have to do some, uh, some changes on that building here. Okay, <clears throat> just a second. I have to stretch my window because the chat preview doesn't work here. I don't know why. Okay, good. Uh, we have to improve that. And for that reason, I loaded the building here. This is the model. So let's move that a little bit. <clears throat> and so I have to work on the roof here because it was open. It was open, but they uh, uh, they closed it. Oh, Twitch says I'm live, but there is no video. Oh, thank you very much. I don't know how, how what I have to do. Uh, so it's good that I have your feedback. Oh, I don't know, actually. Hmm. Let me check that. Okay, I don't know why. I have to check that later. Let's go. Just a second, please. I don't know why. <clears throat> okay, I don't know. I have to fix that later. I'm sorry for that. Uh, for Twitch, it was interesting. I made uh, uh, a question on Instagram and I asked um, many people answered, uh, do you like to... To, to see the videos on, on Twitch too. 
And a lot of people say it, yeah, so I was confused. Wow, because I'm not a gamer actually, I'm not on Twitch and I thought, this is something weird, but a lot of people. So I try to be on Twitch too. Maybe Defro, you could help me uh, sometimes to stream on Twitch. Actually, I work with Restream and it says I'm online. Okay, who knows? Okay, let's go back here. Uh, we have some issues with the roof here and with these holes. I don't like it. When I see the, the picture here, it's just a black hole and that's not nice. So... Uh, let's fix that. Good. Good morning, Alejandro. Good morning. Hi. Uh, so, okay. And then I was in uh, Augusta Rorica for a museum tour. They opened a special museum and they never opened that, I think so. And this is the kiln from inside. So what we see here, these are real uh, bricks and roof tiles. They the Romans left there when they left the building. So this is not placed by the archaeologist. It was actually there. <clears throat> so what we see here in the background are these holes that I talked about. And these holes already or actually existed. So I have to improve them. Okay. Let's turn on the screencast so you see what I'm doing. And here on the side, you see uh, four different levels because for every building, I have four different stages. That means we have a construction stage. This is the final stage. This is the construction stage number one. And then we have here uh, this, the middle one and it goes down. So if you start to build the building, you just see this. This is just for explanation. <clears throat> okay, let's go here. First thing that I want to improve is uh, this one here because we need a hole on the top. And I'm not sure if the model doesn't look nice. I know that it's not perfect, uh, but uh, just make a hole here. I think we can, uh, we should, should we stretch it here? Okay, uh, yeah, that's okay. Hmm. Ah, okay, I made some fake stuff here. Okay, uh, yeah, we do it like this. And then <clears throat> uh, we will... Oh no, okay. Uh, I'm not sure, so like this. And then here. Okay, that's okay, because we, we actually won't see it that that, yeah, I like this. Uh, but what I have to do, I have to bevel this one here. Uh, this lines here. This and this and this and this too. Let's bevel them a little bit. Let's see how it looks. I think it's okay. Uh, I should bevel that too. Good. And here also. Yeah. And what we need here, because it was not uh, white here, I'm actually not sure how it looked here, but uh, I think it was uh, just temporary. Hmm. How can we do that? I think we add here a plane. Oh, okay, we have a sp uh, I have a specific rotation here. I don't know the rotation because I already applied it. This is a mistake that I made when I started with Blender. So, okay. Good, 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 good. Okay. Uh, and now let's, uh, hmm. let's go back here. Uh, let's make some subdivision here. I know this is subdivision modifier, but I like to do it like this way. Then uh, let's do some random uh, random disturption here. Uh, select random. And here I can choose the percentage. I, I would say 0.2. Uh, let's go, let's drag it a little bit. And then uh, let's click on O. So, yeah, it doesn't make sense. Just select some and so. Okay. So, okay. Uh, let's see how it looks. Okay. 
looks good. And now we need a texture and I'm not sure if I should use the, the dirt texture. Oh, I don't have a dirt texture here. Uh, dirt. <clears throat> so, and let's add a texture. Good. The building will look much better later. Um, here we have the dirt texture. Oh, we have some speckler here. I don't like it. Let's see. Ah, not bad. So they were open, uh, but they closed it. And on the sketch, it's weird because they closed it with some tiles. Uh, let's do it. <clears throat> Let's go here and add some tiles. Oh, what? Ah, I already applied it. Hmm. So, we don't need more. It's just they are a little bit too big, but it doesn't matter because uh, you won't see that in the game. Oops. Good. Okay. And uh, let's add a texture. We have a nice texture here. This is this clay texture. In the game, it will have a little bit different color than right now. Clay, okay. Apply rotation scale and then UV projection, so like this. Okay, <clears throat> let's go to the building. Okay. I don't know why it's not live on stream, because it says I'm live. I don't know. Uh, let's go here to normal. Is there a shortcut to switch here? I, this is really annoying to switch all the time. Make it a little bit smaller and here and this one. So we need a, yeah, I think that's okay. You too. Oh, looks nice. Yeah, I like it that it's not straight. It's not 90 degrees. Like this, and then rotate it a little bit. Okay, cool. Okay, and now I think we are coming close to what I actually want. Oh, why I can't move that? Okay. So, and then let's change some textures. Good, and then we can add those here. So, and again, this here. So, and uh, here we want to turn it. Okay, we are, oh gosh. Okay, I can fix that later. Hmm. Yeah, you see, I'm not so experienced. Good, I think that's okay, but uh, so we only, we wanna bring it down here. So let's mark those and bring it down. Now oh, they are already, no, oh, perfect, no. Okay, uh, this one is not great. And this one, oh, these two, so, and this one also. Oh, here in the background. So now I think we are pretty close to the sketch. Good, okay, what do we have to improve? <clears throat> what we have to, uh, I think, okay, the bricks here are the way, the texture is way too big. Uh, just stretch it a little bit. Okay, uh, then here this part, I don't like it. Okay, oh, we have these holes here I talked about. Uh, let's go to the holes. I'm not sure how to fix it. Oh, the texture looks really ugly. It's stretched here. Let's go here and uh, let's see what we can do. Maybe we can stretch it. No, like this. That's oh, much better. What's going on here? Yeah, it's okay. You won't see that. You won't see that. Okay, we have those holes. How can improve it? I could work with um, a bevel modifier. 
I'm not sure if that's a good idea. Let's save it first and then... Oh, somehow my, my blender settings changed because usually I see the lines better. Oh, let's go back and bevel it. Do we see it? Yeah, I think that could be a good idea. Um, ah, I'm not sure because it's too, it's it's not soft here. I need to, so ah, I don't know how to do that. Good morning. Oh, I can't see the name. Good morning. I can't see it because I don't uh, have my glasses on. I have my... Uh, uh, lenses on and I can't see that perfect and it's pretty small. Good morning. Uh, I'm working here on the kiln. Uh, this is the building in the game. This one here and I'm not happy with it because here I need a hole and I don't like uh, the, the holes here so I have to fix that and I was on a research tour in Augusta Rorica to, uh, get, uh, to get some inspiration how the building looks. And here, uh, so I already uh, implemented the hole here, but I'm not happy with that. I'm not sure how to fix it. Usually I do it that way. I I go on this one and then choose, uh, I think global, yeah. Uh, then E for extrude and drag, oh no, I have the O. So like this one here and I go back on, it's just a test on normal and drag it here a little bit. And now, uh, I think I could add here a decal. Do I have a decal texture? No. Okay. Let's add a decal texture. Good. And then here, texture. And where is my decal texture? Here, this one. Oh, you can see when I ch change or choose the texture. So let's go here and apply the, or assign the decal texture. U for unwrap and then let's scale it down. Good. And okay, we are turned. So like this. Oh, why is it white here? Ah, okay. Uh, it makes sense. I have to... Hmm. Okay, delete it. I'm not happy with it. I know what I have to do. Okay, let's add this, this. Oh, thank you. You don't understand uh, English. I'm sorry, I, I can't speak Spanish. Uh, I'm sorry for that. Uh, yeah, but nice that you are here. Thank you very much, Alejandro. Uh, yeah, so let's go here and uh, duplicate it. Hmm. I have the wrong one here. Local is not good. Global? No. Okay. And then E for extrude and C. Yeah, that's what, that's what I want. Okay. Good. Ah, good. Let's see if we... Ah, okay. Good, good. Okay, now we add the, the decals. Ah, okay, I'm not so happy with it. Hmm. It's kind of a mess here. Okay, <laughs> let's work with that. So like this, yeah, it's much better. And uh, I think we can bool in it or no, we will bring it closer here uh, or oh, bevel it here, I'm sorry. What do you wanna say, should we bevel it? This, this, oh, I don't like it. This, 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 we also need, oh, not the bottom one. So we will have a problem then with this and this. Okay, let's bevel just a little bit. Just that. I know it's not perfect. You probably cry when you see that. Uh, but I think from far away, it's okay. Can we see the bevel? 
Hmm. It's okay. Okay, let's go on the back side. Let's do the same again. It's I know it's a mess, but uh, I don't know how to fix it. Duplicate and drag it a little bit. E for extrude and on C scale. And then let's go here. And apply the decal texture. Let's go on cube. And. Oh, okay. Should we also bevel it here? Oh, let's try it. I don't think the effect is, the effect is not so big oh not that one here and here and let's bevel it i'll do it a little bit more than in the front good hmm okay yeah it doesn't look nice here but it will look nice in the game i think so hmm and here why is it flat it was flat on a sketch. Oh, okay. Okay, first I have to fix that. The texture is, the, the brick texture does looks in, look in the wrong direction. It should be in this direction and it's way too big. Oh, this one too. Let's turn it. And they are way too big. So, okay. This one is also a mistake. I actually shouldn't do that that way. I I don't need all those details. Good, okay. Uh, and this one here, I think it's, I have to stretch it more. And this is not nice here, this edge. Uh, let's improve it. Hmm. Ah, okay, here we have the angle 18.7, 18.7. And here I need also 18. 0.7, good, okay. Uh, then we will stretch it, I think here and extend it a little bit. Yeah, that's not bad. And uh, let's give it, oh, we need a concrete texture. Let's add the concrete. Mm, here. Yeah, all the texture that I work with at the moment, they are not available because this is a really old model. Good, okay. Uh, do we need more details here? Okay, let's go here to normal. Oh, mm, not good. <laughs> oh, it's, I don't know why I'm so, I have to focus more. I made a lot of mistake right now. Good. Looks much better than before. And uh, let's go to the reference picture. Yeah, this is okay. Oh, this these edges here are way too sharp. I have to improve them. So they are not nice here. Can we add more details? Mm, let's add more details here. And I think we need a, or we add here concrete texture. Do we also need a concrete texture on the others here? Yeah, I think it's a, it's better because, yeah, it's better. So like this here and here. Good, okay. I'm not sure if it will look cool in the game, but uh, let's try it. Then also the concrete texture. So. Here the same, I would say. Yeah. Oh, here we have we have some problems with the texture, but I will fix that immediately. Also adding the concrete texture. Good. Okay, looking good. Now uh, we have to rotate that and scale it a little bit. It's way too big, and let's go here. Okay, same problem. Let's make it a little bit more beautiful with adding the concrete texture. So, and here, stretch it. So, 
much of improvement and it's way too sharp here. Uh, I don't want to bevel all the details, I just want to bevel that and this line here. And uh, do we see on the reference picture some problems here? Yeah, it's a little bit too sharp. Uh, okay, let's go here. And here too. Okay, and hmm, I'm not sure if I want to bevel. No. And here, just this, this, this. So. Good. Looks much better then. Let's go back on the reference picture. <clears throat> okay, I don't like the wall here. It's it's not realistic. We need some pillars here. I think just two small pillars would be okay. Oh, we have a problem with the texture. Look at this. Looks horrible. Wow. This is this happens usually with my old models. Oh. Ah, the, the, uh, the scale is not applied. Yeah, uh, compared to this one here, it's a little bit too small. Good, okay. Then uh, this is something that I figured out a few months ago. I have to add here also another texture. Whoops. Good. Con I think the concrete texture is okay. Good. Unfortunately, uh, I have this book here. It's a German book. This is uh, one of my main sources for uh, industrial production. We have some really cool details here. Uh, for example, here, how uh, iron production works. Whoops. And uh, it's a pretty interesting book. Uh, unfortunately, there are no information about uh, kilns, so this is really sad. I don't know why, uh, because I thought in that book I could find this information. So, okay. Let's add a pillar. It, it doesn't have to be big, it's just to break the lines a little bit. Yeah, that's okay. Hmm. Oh, global. Good, okay. And also a brick texture. It's completely unrealistic, but you won't see that in the game. And here, and then at the end again, and Let's switch the texture a little bit so we don't have this copy paste style. Cool, okay. Uh, yeah, that's okay here. The roof tiles. Let's go to the reference picture. Uh, yeah, we. I'm not happy with the stones here. We, I think we have too many bricks here on the top. Yeah, that, that's much more realistic. Oh, not that one. And let's turn that a little bit so it looks more realistic. This one here too. Okay, nice. Uh, do we need something else here? We need definitely more. Uh, this is an old model. I, I will add it here. It's okay. Uh, we definitely need more wood here. And uh, yeah, we need much more wood because that's what I figured out when I was on a research tour in Costa Rica. They need a lot of wood, not just a little bit. They need so much wood to burn those stuff. Uh, I, I'm not sure that uh, they burned it for many days, so it's not just uh, uh, a few hours or something like that. Mm, can I copy that? I don't have to redo it again. But I think I need more smaller pieces. I already 
or here we can let's see what's now i no 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 i need that area because the cart when you transport goods uh, the cart will come here into your object and then it turns so i need that space empty here uh, i only can bring it here in the back side but we can do it like this or don't we stretch it a little bit yeah that's okay but we need more wood, more definitely. Okay, I can drag it here and copy paste it here too. But let's turn it and then let's remove some so it doesn't look the same. This one also and here. Okay, yeah, it's realistic. Okay. Hmm. We need more uh, wood locks. Oh gosh, what's wrong? So, ah, oh, okay, this is the rotation that I want. Okay, a little bit too big here, and then rotate it. Oh, I want to have the normal rotation. Mm. So, okay. And let's drag it. Yeah, we need two, three of them here. Uh, so, and let's change the texture. And maybe the scale. Yeah, so it doesn't look perfect. Then let's copy both and bring it to the left. Yeah, that's not bad. And here also the other texture, but I want to stretch it. And this one here too. Good, okay. I'm happy with it. But now we need another one, for example, this one here, and this one is in front. But let's make it smaller. And one that it's turned, or like this here. Also smaller one. Yeah, perfect. So, looks cool. So we have more wood here. Ah, okay, here it's empty too. Uh, let's bring some wood here. This one, oh, let's go here to this. This, 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 and then add some logs. This makes so much fun. I really love to work on buildings and if I could, I would uh, bring in thousands of buildings, but it's technically not possible. Uh, because I really love to model on Roman buildings. So, oh, no, rotate in what direction? On the y-axis. Yeah. Here we also have some wood. And let's see, we need more details here. It's so empty. I think we can copy that. Nobody will notice and bring it to the other side because you can't see both sides at the same time. So that's why you probably never will know that I copied it. Hmm. I don't know what's wrong today. I'm not so focused. This is probably because I had some problems with my teeth this week. I had a lot of pain here. And uh, I still have some problems, still have some pain, but it's getting better. And I thought, don't do the stream today because I'm not so focused. Okay, let's, but uh, now it's okay, I would say. I do some mistakes here, but like this one here. Mm, okay, good. Looks nice, looks nice. And let's bring some of these two here down. 
Why is the, the Z and the Y axis changed? I don't know. I really don't know why. So here. Now, okay, much more decoration stuff. And uh, can we extend that a little bit? Like this. Okay. And uh, bring it here. But then we have the problem. Yeah, that's okay. And this one here on the bottom, it's good. I really like it. Hmm, much better. Let's save it. Okay, uh, what can we improve to? Let's go to the reference picture. Uh, we, I think we need more tiles here. Or do you have any idea what I can improve? I'm not sure. Maybe more of these roof tiles here? Yeah, we can add more. It's not a lot of performance problem if I add more of those. Uh, I'm not sure what I can improve. Hmm. So, oh, it's not nice here, the texture. It's pretty blurry. Yeah, much better. Any idea what I can improve? Any idea? I don't know. I need the space here empty. Here, I think it has to be empty too because we need the space to bring in. But hmm, we can add here another shelf for the bricks now. That's pretty unrealistic. We can bring some locks here. For example, those. Yeah, oh, that's that's a cool idea. We'll bring that down. Okay, like here, and then we can burn them. Oh. Yeah, and yeah, you won't see that. You you are not so close. And uh, we can bring some locks here in the oven. Like here. Oh, it's, it makes much more fun to improve buildings than actually create. So I'm really free. Yeah, but let's scale them down. They are way too big here. And there is a fire, so you won't see them probably. So I'll bring them out a little bit because the fire will hide everything. Okay, what we can improve? Hmm. Let's see, I think it's not bad. I'm not so happy with this side here. Let's check the reference picture. Okay. Hmm. Let's check that. No, they are okay. Maybe we can add here something like this. And we can bring here at the edge uh, a disturption. And uh, probably here too. Here also at the edge. And here maybe. So let's scale it a little bit. And rotate it. So it doesn't look that perfect. And maybe we can bring it down. Yeah, so it's not perfect. Hmm. What can we improve? Hmm, not sure, not sure. Maybe here we can bring some concrete pillars or basements like this. And I think then we have it. Uh, we don't have to to upgrade some, some things that are that are already cool, I think so. With my skills, probably you're much better, but I'm still trying to figure out how I can be a good mm, uh, building modeler. So, mm, do we have to bevel those? Uh, oh, I already beveled them. 
by hand. Yeah, okay. Here, is, let's make here uh, something that it's weird you, th you think what's here, but uh, just let's add it. So, and concrete. Cool, looks nice, looks really nice. Here we know, oh wow. What's about here? Let's see this line here. That's okay. And what do we have to improve? No, I think it's okay. Maybe the stair here. Let's check if we can bevel the stair. Yeah, we can bevel it. This and this and this and this. Probably I can Hmm, no, that's not a good idea. No, that's not a good idea. Hmm. I think that's okay. So let's save it. And yeah, are you happy with the building? It's the the, the smallest kiln. Then I will switch to the other building. But first I have to go back here on this one. Oh, all the stuff that I implemented will be in zero. And then let's go to the this one here because we need the whole, ah, okay. I can delete it and I can bring it here, this one, duplicate, move to 25. So we also have it here and here. Ah, okay. we. Oh. Okay, we also need it here. And check it. Yeah, works. Here we don't need it yet. How it looks here from the back side. Mm, it's okay. It's not the, the most beautiful construction uh, building, but I think it's okay. Good. Okay, looks cool. Something else that we need? Mm. Let's check the... Let's check this here. Do we need some stones here? No. Uh, maybe a border, that could be cool, but uh, I have to be careful with the scale. And I think then we are okay. Uh, let's bring it here, where are we? Minus, minus 2.5. So, okay, this should be the border. <clears throat> hey, good morning. Oh, <laughs> the window is so small, I can't see your name, and I have no glasses on. Take two to. I can't read it. I'm sorry. Usually I work with my glasses, but then I have too, too many uh, lights here, so it mirrors too much. That's why I can't see so good. I'm sorry for that, and it's pretty small here. But thank you for the feedback. But I think we will switch immediately to the other building. I just want to make this one here uh, to make some kind of a border. To so, and probably let's turn it a little bit. This one here. It's always a trial and error because I don't have a clue what I have to do. I never learned design or something like that. And uh, th this is a job that you actually have to study and I just tr do what I think it's okay. Then I see, okay, I don't like it. And uh, so it's a lot of trial and error. I would be much faster if I know what I have to do. But uh, yeah, we have to live with that. <clears throat> Let's copy those. So, oh, so, ah, I missed one. Hmm, so, yeah, now we are done. Just save it and 
here, this one here. Good, okay. Oh no, we need a little bit more disturption here. So it should not be too straight. Yeah, let's save it, okay. I feel you, I'm also stuck with the trial and error. Oh, okay, what the, what do you do? Do you have a project or uh, please post it here if, if you work on something. I can't see the name perfect. Uh, I just can see your message. So uh, please share it. What do, what do you do? Do you work on a computer game? You just do rendering or something like that? Or ju you just uh, try to figure out how, how Blender works? Good, let's save it and let's open the other model. I wanna go and improve that one here. Uh, this is the more realistic or more accurate one. This one that I worked on, it's a fantasy building. Save it, yeah, for sure. And you can see what's going on on my screen right now because I opened the other building. Okay, good, we are here, we are back, uh, Bo. Let's see, where is my building? Hmm. Where is my building? Okay. I have to load probably everything. Where is it? Ah, it's here. This is weird. Okay. I don't want to have the decals. I don't want to have the human. Uh, and this is the 24? Holy cow, there's something wrong here. I probably deleted the building. Oh, you're looking for one hour. Oh, good morning. Hi, Gummibärchen. Is that a kiln for wood coal? This is a kiln in Gegenbach in Germany. I was there for research and it's a pretty accurate copy, really. I measured everything, just the wall around, it's not accurate. And uh, they, this is a kiln for burning uh, bricks. So you put in some fire here and then you have some here inside, it's not uh, finished, but you have some holes and uh, the heat goes through the holes and on the top you will see the, oh, you will have the bricks. Just a second, I will show you how it works. It's the same building that we have before. Uh, you can't see what I load right now. I just wanna load it. So, this is the building from Augusta Rorica. So, there is a tunnel under this, uh, under this surface here, and you see the holes. We have different holes here, for example, here, 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 and here. So the, the warm air goes up and dry those bricks for many days. It used, uh, they used a lot of wood for doing that. And when we, this is not the same building, what we see here. This is just for me to figure out how it works. So this is the entrance to bring in the stuff here and this is uh, the entrance here. And the tunnel, we can't see it, it's on the other side. It's a huge tunnel and I could go inside and it's uh, freaking scary there. I don't know how the slaves work there. It's so small and yeah. Okay, just for understanding how it works. Uh, not really anything to show, just learning 3D modeling, decent knowledge in Unity Engine, animation store, the game project. Uh, aiming, sorry, not Emmy, animation. Oh yeah, if you have some question about Unity, uh, just text me. Uh, I'm on Facebook, Instagram, I'm almost everywhere. Just text me if you have some problems and then I can help you because this is something that I really missed when I started uh, because nobody helped me. So let's import it. I'm not sure. Uh, just a second, I will import some stuff. I'm not sure where is my building. I hope I didn't delete it. Oh, it's loading and loading and loading. Oh, you're welcome. So where is the building? Is it this? Yeah, I think so. 
Okay, this is the building, but where are my details here? Where are all the details? The way, the stuff here. I probably deleted all. Oh no. Yeah, I probably deleted it. I have to redo it again. Okay, stick. Where are the stick? Okay, the stick is empty. The decals, we don't need it. We don't need the human. Okay. Unfortunately, I deleted all the stuff here, but this is the stuff that I actually didn't like. So I have to fix that. I'm not happy with the uh, with the chimney here. It's, uh, it's weird. But... Uh, I think it's this is just too big. Yeah, I would say that's much better. It's not perfect, and let's apply the rotation scale. You can work as a teacher. I'm actually a teacher. <laughs> yeah, I'm actually a teacher. Uh, I have two jobs. I work as a real estate agent, and my second job, and the second job is just to finance the game because it's pretty pretty expensive i work as a teacher in the in economy uh, so i uh yeah i teach uh, not this week i have i will have a new class in about in, in about 10 days but i only do it at night or in the evening so yeah i need a lot of energy for doing that so and i love uh, to uh, to see when people getting better in something and I could help that's that's amazing so I beveled it a little bit and I would say it's okay it's much better than before thanks but I oh Unreal Engine <laughs> I'm sorry <laughs> it's too small uh, no I can't help you with Unreal but sometimes here uh, there is a, a Somebody in the chat uh, is called Death Row, and he has a Twitch stream, and he streams uh, how he develop in in the Unreal Engine. So if you have some question, I think you can definitely ask him. He's a really nice guy. Hey, have a great day, and uh, Gummibärchen, and uh, hope we see each other again. Have a great weekend. Ah, oh, Death Row, it's here. Okay, hey, the, uh, I can't see it. It's too small. I'm sorry. Uh, uh, there is a guy. Uh, maybe you can post your, your Twitch stream again here and uh, uh, the link and he can contact you and he can uh, subscribe your channel. Okay, uh, what we need? We need a way here. Uh, let's go. Okay, no, I have to, mm, let's copy, copy those. Let's copy all, duplicate and move it to a new collection called one. So then I can go close that. So, okay. Oh, there is something, we need something here. Uh, da, da, da. 16 is okay. So I don't have any clue about the Unreal Engine, but it looks pretty similar to Unity when I watch uh, Death Row streams. It's not the same concept, but the same logic, I would say. So not bad. Roof here. Uh, da, 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 da. So. So good. Yes, you too. We speak then for a reason. So. Good. This is a really important thing to do, to bring that on the roof. When I see some render stuff, I always check how they solved the angle here, or the point here when they have a roof. And uh, this is something that I saw on a render and I thought that's a pretty cool idea to solve my problem. Okay, we have this ramp. This was on the sketch. Uh, 
we need a door here, do we need a metal door? Ah, that will, looks really cool. So, here and then, oh no. Hmm. Good. It seems that my Twitch stream doesn't work. It's the first try and uh, I have to fix that. I will ask Defro later how I can fix it, why it didn't work. So... Oh no. Okay. Yeah, that's, that's perfect. Let's see if we have some iron. No, we don't have an iron texture. We need one iron because I want to have an iron door. So, okay, you can see what I do because I load a texture. I look for a iron texture uh, and, ah, oh, here, rust texture. And uh, let's delete those, oops. And this one I want to, oh no, this one I want to change. We need also a handle here. I'm always scared when death row is here. <laughs> no, it's a joke because uh, you're pretty good and you know, uh, you see every mistake that I do when I don't work with the array modifier. I'm pretty glad that you helped me because sometimes uh, you need a, an, an input from another person. Uh, let's add here concrete texture. It's not realistic, but uh, you won't see that it's concrete. You just will see that it's a different texture. Good. Oh, true worked a little bit with Unity when it was released for free several years ago. It should be still free for free. I'm not sure how how it's uh, the Unreal en Engine, is, is it also for free? I think so, I would say. Uh, Unity is definitely for free. If you don't have a, a, a project that uh, you already sell some stuff. So, good, okay. Uh, let's go here to the 50. Mm, this, the entrance is too small, but okay. Yeah, both are free, okay. So. Let's bring the, we need a way, a pathway here. Add it a little, like this. And this is pretty cool, but uh, this is difficult if you're new to Blender. We can make a round, uh, round way here. So we go on the top view, then I choose the new center. I, The new center has to be on line with this, but I don't want to have it perfect, so I move it here, and then I go to this menu here and choose this one. And and sometimes you have to change here the, the angle and this is the perfect, so I can stretch it. And you see the problem, uh, this is not realistic. It depends on my center. Let's move the center here. Yeah, that's what I actually want. Yeah, this is perfect. Okay. And uh, do we need 12 steps? No, I think not. Okay. And then Unreal is for free, you pay after making a million. <laughs> okay. Uh, <laughs> a million, okay. Uh, here. And then we can extend it. Oh. Okay, <laughs> one million. Yeah, I'm glad that I don't do that game for money. I will, it won't be for free because I have some expenses already, but uh, I don't have to live with the money from the game. So I'm really free. If I don't like anything, if I need more time, who cares? Uh, I'm, I'm a free guy. That's the most important thing. I, I think so. So many people think they have to be rich and have to be wealthy. Yeah, it doesn't make you happy. I think so. 
Okay, and uh, we need a ground texture. I like that texture here. What is stone floor? Or what do you think? Uh, is it important to be wealthy? Probably you think it's okay, but it's not the way of life that I want to choose. So now we need some stones here that we had by the last building. Let's make it here and uh, yeah, because we will copy that, I will delete that face here and let's make it a concrete texture. Because if I would do the game for uh, earning a lot of money, I, the game would be already finished. Uh, but I put so much effort in it, I go on research tours uh, and this is also expensive traveling. I never thought that, but uh, just driving to Germany, 1000 kilometers, it costs, it's not for free. <clears throat> or do I have to switch to normal here? Probably, no, I already messed it up. Yeah, no, I could do that with the array modifier, definitely, but then it will look not so real. It will look fake. That's why I use different... This one here is a little bit more up, and this here. Good. Would you build a game dev studio if you put... No. No, no, no. I have already a plan for uh, a second game, but uh, I want to focus on that one. The second game will also will be a completely different thing, but this is... Uh, I have two, two dreams. This is one of my dream, and uh, the other game probably in a few years. No, I have a good job. I'm happy with my life. I don't want to have more stress because I spent every free minute uh, and uh, on the game and... No, I don't want to have a studio or run or work in a studio. This is just a hobby. Would you, would you, uh, is it a dream? Uh, would you open or establish a, a game studio? Why not? If you like it, just try it. Is that, is that something that you want to do? Oh, the, I, I know it's not perfect here, but uh, it's, it, it should not be perfect. Probably there is a better approach to turn those tiles here. <laughs> so... A Greek city builder? No, I don't like the ancient Greeks. It's not the current... No, I am just... Uh, no, it's completely different. It's not a secret, but I just want to think about that uh, because I want to focus on that game here. It's not a secret. It's it's still difficult to explain. It will be a mobile game. Something like chess, for example. Yeah, something like chess. So completely different. But no, I want to work on that one here. This is my life. I love to work on the game. Look at this, we will have a beautiful kiln. And this is a real copy. This is not fake or fantasy. This is based on a academic sketch I found uh, at the site in Germany. So, I drove about, I think four hours, both way, two hour, one way, just to see the ruins. So, but I can't show you the sketch because in Germany uh, it's pretty weird with uh, the license to show some pictures. So I don't want to have any copyright issues. I, don't, I can't show it here. Hey, it looks cool. We're coming to an end with the floor here. Yes, I would working on my own terms on things I'm passionate about. That's... 
Yeah, then you should start. How old are you if if I uh, if if this is okay to ask you? Because I I'm a teacher for business planning at the universities, different universities, and I can give you an advice. Oh, why is this flickering here? Why is it flickering? Oh. Ah, okay. Uh, this is flickering here. Okay. Uh, my advice to you is, if you have a dream, uh, make a, a, a very uh, focused goal. You need a goal, not just I want to have. A, uh, I want to have a, my own company. You have to think about how big the company has to be, uh, how many employees you want to have, uh, what's your dream? Do you want to be rich or just want to have your company? You have to have a, a pretty clear goal. This is the most important thing. And then start. Don't wait. Uh, because as older you get, you you less energy you have. So just start with it. Uh, Try your dream and don't try it with 50, try it with 25 because if you fail, you can restart. If you if you fail with 50 at age 50, it's pretty hard. So just start. Uh, not stupid, you, you need a plan, you need real goals, but uh, don't wait too long. So... And that's pretty sad. Some of my students have really cool ideas. Actually, I had a group of students, they had a cool idea, business idea, and I told them, hey guys, do it. I will invest immediately in your business, but do it. And they were kind of lazy, or I don't know. And uh, three or four years later, another company did it and they are really successful. And the students wrote me, hey man, we, why we didn't start it. I said, yes, I said to you, start with your dream. That's what I love about your work, all the research that you do for the project. I'm 30, okay, start. Let's go out, start. <laughs> start, start, it's really important. Uh, you're not too late. Uh, I, I established my second or third company at your age. And that doesn't mean that uh, you're already late. So uh, my company is really successful right now. Uh, I'm, I'm happy for that. But uh, successful means I'm happy with my job. Uh, it's not everything or all about money. And uh, just start. And don't think... This is a problem of our generation. You and I, we are almost the same generation. Uh, we think everything happened in one or two years. No, you need uh, you 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 need a many years until you see that your business is going good. What business is going good in one or two year? No, you need a lot of time. Uh, you you need a lot of passion, and you have to wait. Okay, now we need here uh, a shelf for our bricks. Here we have some amphoras. Let's add a shelf that I missed somewhere. I don't know why it's deleted. That happened in the beginning and this is a pretty old building. But I don't want to have as here this large shelf. I want to have multiple shelves here. And let's go on the bottom side and delete the face. And let's go here and... Oh, you can not see probably like this. And then here, you don't need a business plan. This is, uh, it's not necessary if you want to bring your own company, but I would recommend that you do a business plan. Uh, I don't do it. I don't, I do it in my head, but it's my third, fourth. I don't know how many companies I already uh, established and sold and shut down, but uh, I do it when in my head, in my mind. So I, a business plan is really important, but I don't do it formally. I just think about, but if you never established a company, you should definitely do that, really. This is really, really important. Good, let's drag it up and here. 
and then just start, just start today. Bring your idea on your paper. Another important thing that I could give you if you want to establish your own business, uh, usually my rule is if I have for, if I have 100 ideas, only one works. So it doesn't necessary, uh, your, your idea is not necessarily successful, but if you don't try it, you don't know it. So, okay. Let's bring it here. And on the side, uh, okay, let's move the center of origin to center of mass and then, whoops, here. Let's turn it on the y-axis. So, maybe this one here, no, ah, no. Only one direction on this side and one direction here, but here we wanna have it on both sides. Yeah, about your your input about the research. Uh, I've never actually never been to Rome. That's something that I want to go uh, and to Pompeii. So all this fancy stuff I never saw in real. I, I saw almost every Roman stone in Switzerland, but not uh, the famous one. Okay, what do we have here? We have the burned kilns, uh, bricks. Okay. Uh, oh, we can take this. Just add another texture. Have you been to Rome? Success is hard work. Yeah, notice that when I try to become professional writer, now I end up with oh, side gigs for, let's say. Oh, interesting. In, very interesting. Thank you for letting me know because uh, maybe you know, Matthew A. Godwin is a fantasy book author. He's a professional writer. And he writes the story for the game. Uh, he contacted me a year ago and I said, hey, I really love the project. I'm a big fan of Romans. And uh, I want to write a story for you. Oh, just a second. We need the brick texture here. And I made an interview with him. It's not published right now because <laughs> I made a mistake. Yeah, it's a little bit stupid, I know. Uh, I... Uh, the, the microphone was not working so the whole we have to redo the whole interview next week and he was this is really interesting he was a, actually a zookeeper and then he started to live his own dream with by writing books so he write books for uh, for yeah for his life he is a professional book writer but he started as a zookeeper and i think this is really interesting and when i do uh, uh, I will publish the interview in about one month, I think in the beginning of December, and that could be really interesting. So did you publish the book or uh, did you try to publish? If you published one, uh, could, you, could you insert here the ISBN number or the title? What kind of books do you write? Uh, fantasy books or history stories? Light rotation scale and now we need other textures whoops oh no this one here oh where can we use it here oh yeah here I'm sorry it's so small I have to uh, I'm not sure if I read everything correct you said the Unreal Engine and Oh no, another one, Death Rose. Ah, oh, Death Rose is it. Oh, I'm sorry, I, 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 uh, I was not sure I thought take to the, I can't read it. I'm sorry for that. I mixed you up two guys. Death Row, you're a book author. Okay, so. I don't know why, I always have problems by streaming. Sometimes the, the audio doesn't work, sometimes everything. 
I don't know. So. I wasted so much money with uh, business ideas I had and they failed. Yeah, that's the way it is. But I always had fun. Good, let's turn it. Oh, thank you very much. It's a military fiction book about a German... I can't read it about... Oh, I can't read it. I will read it later. Thank you very much. This is nice. So you actually published one? Wow. It's a lot of work, I think. So I never published a book. I had an idea, but it's, it's a stupid idea. I don't have any... Uh, no, I, that's not... I'm not, I will, won't be good in that. <laughs> so, how long did it take to write the book? I think the research is, you need also time for research. And how long did it take? More than a year? And now you work on a computer game. You're a really creative guy. So, let's, ah, okay, we have the same texture everywhere. So, and move it. A lot of work and a lot of investment. <laughs> okay, I can imagine that. But it's, uh, I think it's a lot of passion. It makes you happy and... Uh, it makes you sad if nobody buys your book. Because uh, you you know it's, yeah, if you invest a lot of money and time and nobody take care about, it's hard. I don't know how many, uh, how many items you sold, but uh, I think it's pretty competitive. So, okay, we have the shelf and uh, let's copy it. Oh no, I just want to copy the shelf. So guys, 10 minutes left. I don't want to stream longer. I want to go out on the bike. I have to do some sports. Let's delete some here. So we have bring them here and probably here so we have a little bit more variety oh you're a quick writer look me about two years from st wow two years two years holy cow <laughs> okay wow so Ah, okay, I have to rotate it so we see it here. These are the burn bricks. They are ready to bring it to the uh, to the brick storage, and we need some wood here. Hmm, I uh, this is yeah, this, that was a good idea. Let's add some physics. We did it the last time when I was when I created the brick factory, and then we will add some locks here. Yeah, it was not success I hoped for. It was an overhaul. There is experiment that worked. The following never stopped, and writing still. Oh wow! Yeah, but. What is success? Okay, you, you probably measure success with, uh, with the, the, the items you sold, but it could be also success that you're happy when you wrote the book. I think this is also important. Good. 
Okay, now let's add here, oh, I don't know, uh, the richer body, and this is a passive one. Now let's add a lock. Whoops, so we did that the last time. I don't do it a lot, so I don't have any clue how it works exactly. I just do trial and error. This one, and then add a lock or wood. What texture did we use here? This is, oh gosh, here, uh, stick, the stick texture. Let's add it here, stick. So. Ah, uh, oh, this one here, it was that texture here. Okay, and let's add here the rigid body active. Oh, then, hmm, how it, then here we need our timeline. Let's save it first and let's click on play. Why it jumped? What's wrong? Huh? What's going on? Yeah, this is because I don't have a clue. Let's do... Why? Ah, okay. The problem is... Ah, okay. The problem is I have to change here the... The volume, the shape, it's a, a mesh. Yeah, so, good. You, you're proud that you did it. Lese Richtschreibschwäche. I don't know. Uh, okay, wow. Okay. I... Uh, <laughs> Yeah, it's exactly. That, that's a, I think that's also success. You are happy that you did it and you finished it and you published it. This is also success, not, not only the uh, sold pieces. So let's go here. They should not... Here. And now let's... Yeah, this is so sad when I see YouTube videos with uh, young guys, they call, they said you have to invest in crypto, then you get rich and something else. It's okay, but why do you want to be rich? It's okay. Let's test it. Good. Okay. Not uh, exactly what I want, but let's... Let's bring them a little bit to the center. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Oh, I'm not sure. Hmm. Uh, I'm not sure if I should do it that way. Let's check it. Hmm. Oh, not bad. Not bad. This is what I want. Okay. Uh, hmm. And as I told you the last time, I don't know how the process is to... Maybe that row you know it. Uh, I only want to have those sticks. I, I don't have any clue how to so okay and now I don't have any clue how I can save that state so uh, I have to export it 
file export as an FBX somewhere. Uh, logs, just, just the mesh. And then I go back, delete the stuff, delete this one here, delete that one, go back. Oh, I don't need them. So, and now I have to import that. I don't have any clue how I can f save the state. Uh, just a second, uh, logs import. Okay, it's, it's freezing. Oh, he, ah, okay. Uh, I don't need, mm. Okay, <laughs> what a mess. So, but now I have it here. Oh, again, again, I made a mistake. Oh, what's going on? No, I just want to have those. So, and this one here. So now join them. Okay. Hey, Matteo, hi. How are you? What's wrong with... There is something wrong here. Oh, going back. I probably made a mistake when I imported that. Oh gosh, okay, I have to reload it. Uh, Brickworks 2. I hoped I saved it before I did it. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's do it different way. I don't like it. It's a, It doesn't work. Thank you very much, thank you. It's a kiln, it's a uh, pretty accurate copy of one. Um, we need some locks here. I'm too lazy for that. Let's save it, let's go back to the other one uh, that we worked before uh, because I wanna bring those stuff here. I wanna have this one here, I'm too lazy. We will export that, and this one here too. File export, so, and export it to the desktop. You can't see what I do. We just have oh, five minutes left. Locks. Let's go back to the other one. No, don't save. And now let's import it. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's the problem. That's the problem. And uh, I forget to apply the, uh, the check mark, the correct one. That's definitely the problem. Okay. Oh, they are too small. I have probably another scale. Too small. We make all ah. so and a smaller version. Then we have those five minutes. I don't want to stream longer, I want to go on the bike. Okay, rotate it. I'm thinking about the Senate meeting. I want to talk about the Empire map, map because I'm working on the Empire map right now with the trade routes. And I want to ask you some stuff what we can do on the Empire map. I think I will start a Senate meeting 
but I'm not sure if I have enough people there are interested in it because then we need in minimum three or four people live on the channel that we can discuss. So I'm not sure about that. Okay, let's move them. Oh. So. And. Yeah, I wanna move that to the back side of the house too. Here we have also some wood. So. Okay. Hmm. What do we need here? Oh, I had some for us here. Let's import one if I have one. Just a second. I'm importing some stuff. Uh, just a second. I will be back right now. I'll just look for the Amphoras. I don't want to do it again. So, for uh, this one here. Let's see which one. Oh, I don't like that. Oh, I can use it. So, it's just the wrong texture. No, it's not nice. It's not nice. Let's import another amphora. Amphora 2. Let's see. I have different amphoras. Ah, oh, this is the one I looked for. Let's give it a texture. Uh, clay. Do I have the clay texture here? No. So I need the clay texture. Clay. And here, so three or four minutes, then we are done. You can see what I do because uh, I'm importing. Yeah, it's not the same texture as we will have in the game engine. Okay. Uh, Stretch it a little bit in this direction. You won't see that. Copy, copy, copy. I have to hurry. Two minutes. Probably will be late. <clears throat> so. Because they don't just burn bricks here. They also burn some pottery, I think so. Uh, plank texture. Good. So. I know that the UV map is not perfect, uh, but you won't see it. We are way too far away. Like this. Yanis told me I should name my objects here, or he laughed about because I don't name my stuff here. Yeah, you're definitely right, but uh, I'm just lazy. Good. Uh, what we need? We need some more here. So, and this one. Yeah, the UV texture doesn't look nice. I'm thinking about to publish a video today on Discord uh, to show what I'm working on because I think people, uh, the there is no progress on the game. It's a lot of progress, but it's just a lot of coding. So you can see a lot and probably I make a, a video, short video, what I'm working on and how it, how uh, the trade route is already working or not. I have some bugs. Yeah, that's okay. I think so.
<laughs> yeah, you're right. Uh, because I, I know when I click on this, it's an Amphora. If you're definitely right, if I work with a, uh, why do we have an animation here? There is an animation on the on the Amphora. This is weird. This is this is probably because I bought that Amphora and. Why I can't delete the keyframes? I'm confused. Ah, oh, it's on one. Huh? Now I deleted the whole on four. I don't know. I want import uh, export the animation, so it doesn't matter. Discord video sounds good. Yeah. Uh, yeah. The idea is I will show uh, the the. In, in the game engine where I work, so I, you don't see the game actually, you just see uh, how I work and I will explain what problem I have at the moment. So, actually I'm f I should be finished since seven minutes, but here it's so empty and here it's empty. I'm not happy, I wanna finish this building. Okay, let's give us 10 minutes. I wanna finish it. So, so, and we have an amphora at the ground. Like, make it a little bit smaller. Here, this is a missing one. Yeah, that's okay. And oh, these sticks here, they could be really cool at the wall. So, yeah, not bad. Not that one, this one here. Yeah, that's what I want. So, do we need, how about some form of benches? For slaves? No! <laughs> Good idea. Here? A table and a bench for? Let's do it. Oh, I have... Oh, no, no. I need the human as a reference. So we have the perfect scale. So, okay, the bench. For slaves? I can't believe. These are slaves. They don't have to rest. I know that's not nice, but it seems not logical to me. Good. I know it's not realistic that these sticks are here, they should be here, but then it looks much cooler with the, I have an effect in, in Unity, the game engine. It's, uh, I don't know the name, it's some kind of a shadow effect and then it looks really cool. So we have the bench here, then we need a table. It's just from one side, it's too narrow here. So, and they are not allowed to talk to each other. That's why they sit like this, okay. For the slave sup supervisor, ah, okay. Okay, makes sense. Not at the table, here. Good. I think that's a cool idea. So we have, but uh, this one is too close. I should move it a little bit. 
yeah, and turn it just a few like this. Do we need something on the table? Yeah, let's make a towel on the table. It's for the supervisors. Okay, and like this. Oh, I'm stupid. I shouldn't do that. Like this, and then like that. And then, oh, no. Bevel it here. And here we want to make an effect. So I think then we are done for today. Do we will see the effect here? Probably. And here. Oh. Let's try it and we need, uh, I don't know the word in English. Let's name it carpet. Okay, let's look for a carpet texture just a second. Uh, I should have a carpet texture here somewhere. Mm, green one. Yeah, not bad. Okay, think looks good. Hmm, I'm still not so happy with it. Uh, I don't like this 90 degrees angle here. Uh, I think we will do that uh, probably the next weekend. Uh, I will improve this building again because I'm not happy here with the wall. Maybe I destroyed the wall, I'm not sure. But thank you very, very much for watching today. I have to save it. And uh, yeah, I will definitely will uh, make a video on Discord probably today or tomorrow i'm not sure probably today thank you very very much for being here thank you that we have so many viewers today it's on saturday morning and uh, thank you very much for supporting the game i hope we see you soon next stream thank you goodbye